Hi everyone. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> Look who is in the house. Aurelie dons a lot. And Nico Hockenberg, slightly, slightly more important. Ooh. Hello. <laughs> All right, we're live. We're from the uh, German Grand Prix paddock. I'm speaking to a German driver. Hello, guten Tag. Hello, guten Tag. Wie geht's Ihnen? Uh, sehr gut, danke. Und du? Mir geht's wunderbar. Ich bin im schönen Deutschland. Hatte ein schönes Frühstück heute Morgen mit deutschen Brötchen und allem Tamtam. -Tam. Von daher, mir könnte es nicht besser gehen, Aurelie. Yeah, of course. I agree with you completely. I also love breakfast. Good. Yeah, was that right? <laughs> You could do the whole thing in German and I could do it in English or French, but I think the conversation is going to dry up quite quickly. It could be quite fun. So English or German for me? I think, let's, let's stick with German. No, let's stick with English, sorry. Just most people speak English on here. Okay. Hello. Um, <laughs> hey, listen, you guys, we're going to look at the comments, so feel free to uh, send us some questions. We're looking through the glasses. Um, but I actually do have a few things that I wanted to talk to you about. I really wanted to talk about the Hockenheim ring and your history here. Mm. Because it's a good one. It is a good one. You've done very well here in the past. Yep. Um, I actually have some photos from 2005 where you look incredibly cute. Actually, I've done pretty well everywhere up to Formula One. Oh. And then I sort of got sucked. Oh. <laughs> but you're not, you're not done yet. We're here this weekend. <laughs> Hey, we're here. <laughs> Talk to me about... Um, another day, another race. Absolutely. Well, Sunday. Another day, another media day today, but... <laughs> um, talk to me about the first time that you raced here in a single seat dinner. Yeah, the first time was uh, 2005 in Formula BMW. Uh, it was my first year in single seat racing yeah. and uh, this was the first race weekend of the year. Um, in the, you know, we were together with the DTM championship and we were like the support race. And believe it or not, I smashed it. I won the first bloody race. Can you believe it? And I think on, on the second one, it was a wet race. And then obviously, I think because I won, then it was reverse grid. So yeah. Saturday, I started from P8. Right. It was a wet, wet race. Then I finished on the podium again, second or third. And I think Chico, you know Chico? Yes. You know the guy from Force India? Yeah, I think he was, uh, or maybe I won them too. Maybe I won I both. I think you won both. I've got photos. I'm going to share them later with everybody. Fuck, I'm good. You can't swear! Say sorry! <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Checo was second fun. then. <laughs> second was Checo then. Yeah, yeah. And there was... Um, That's Chris, where Chris our... Chris Drift was the other driver on there. Oh, yeah, yeah. He was also in the BMW support uh, yeah, yeah. crew there. That yeah, was good. It was uh, obviously a good first weekend, good impact, which people like to see, but... That was my first memory of Hockenheim. Nice. Actually, I think my first ever test in a single-seater also was actually here. In, in a very hot summer day in 2004. In an open track day, there was all sorts of cars, and yeah, I was amongst that too. But uh, yeah, and then Formula Three, I raced quite a bit here. Yeah. Also won a few times, I believe, and uh, yeah. You've got quite a special relationship with the number seven as well. And my little list on this little little notes number over seven. there. Yeah. Your last two outings at the Hockenheim Ring, you finished P7. In Formula One? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So two years ago. Thanks for reminding me. With upping friends. You can do better this weekend. Um, Look, it sometimes goes in. I'm, I'm also told you scored points at the last four German Grand Prix. So, ninth in 2012. You were told, so you haven't done this, this research these yourself. These are my notes. No way, I have minions. I have asked for information. <laughs> I've been sent some very I have helpful. minions. <laughs> They're watching as well. <laughs> I've seen them log on. <laughs> minions. Do you have Absolutely. to pay these minions? Uh, they, they are employed by the uh, company, yes, uh. of course. <laughs> And how are you feeling for this weekend? Does it actually mean something to race on your home Grand Prix? Is it that extra special? Is there something to it? Or is it just I mean, mythical and not real? No, I, yes and no. Of course it is special. And it's also because of all the history I had here and the memories. I really like coming here. Yeah. For me, it's already when you drive into Hockenheim, you know, over the bridge, the highway, and then the tunnel into the track. It has kind of a special atmosphere and yeah. special vibe here. The, the racing, you feel the racing history. So I, I enjoy that when I come into a track and Hockenheim is one of those places for me that, that provides this feeling. Um, and then, of course, yes, it's a lot of family here, a lot of maybe a little bit of extra attention on, on, on what I do. But, you know, for me personally, I, I'm giving it my best and 100% every race weekend, you know, otherwise I wouldn't be very professional, right? So um, I just do what I have been doing, which yeah. is working okay. It's all right, <laughs> yeah, um, you all right. But yeah, I mean, obviously, hopefully there will be a little bit extra home support here. 
You've um, just gone round the gone round the track. You've overseen the track in a helicopter. I have. Yeah. What was that like? It was good. A little bit scary. The 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 pilot got a little bit excited at times and wanted to show us some some of his moves. <laughs> a little bit of banking, you know, and he almost did the screw and the backflip and what what have you. But uh, yeah, it was fun. You know, it's kind of a different perspective to see it out from the air. But. Uh, it was, was a nice feature. It was a bit of a track guide, which Fom probably will use, so you guys can can, can enjoy that yeah. too. We'll make sure we share it as soon as it's available. Um, do you consider that's the track we've done? Say hi to Luca. Hi, Ciao, Luca. Luca. <laughs> Françoise. Ah, yeah. Felicitations. 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 Les équipes les bleus. Les bleus, ouais. That was pretty nice and amazing, no? They really smashed it. That was amazing, yeah. Mm. Archul, um, we can break the news here. You've got two stars on your car, um, on the nose of the car, so does Carlos, obviously, to uh, pay tribute to the um, L'Equipe Française de Foot. The news are broken, guys. There you you go. were their life. Wow. <laughs> um, you know when you were talking to me? Who is uh, replying this? Uh, that's that's someone watching uh, using the team account. That shouldn't be uh, using the team account. Oh, that's one of the minions. Did you ever drive the old Hockenheim, Hockenheim ring, Nico? No, Thanks, never. Paul. I don't know when they converted the track, but it was well before my time in Formula One or in, and even in racing. So, no, I never got to to enjoy that, unfortunately. Shame. What about um, you alluded to it in the helicopter when the pilot was showing off his skills as a Formula One driver? Do you have, if you get someone that's driving you, do you do they have a tendency to um, show off their driving skills because you're in the car? Some people yes, some people don't. It's I think you can't say it's not always the same. Yeah. It just depends on the on the person and the character, I suppose. But some do, and but you know I'm not shy. I tell them straight away. I think do, so. Yeah. <laughs> chill. You don't need to prove anything to me, and I I want to be relaxed, relaxed now. So <laughs> take it easy. I see Tanya hello. there, she's in Mercedes kit, Tanya Bauer. Oh, hello. I need to find out what's going on. What's going on there? What minions, is going on? minions, go and find, find out. out. Tanya, Tanya Bauer, X guy, <laughs> now in Mercedes team kit. What's going on? Find out. Should so, we go do that? That was nice, that but note, I think yeah. your five minutes are up. Or? Say goodbye to the fans. Bye, Bye guys. <laughs>